Special Olympics Spring Games kicked off today. Athletes across Pickens County showing up and showing out. Mm -hmm. Fox Carolina's Anna Arinder went to Southern Wesleyan University to catch all the action. When you look around, you can't help but smile. There's also that competitive energy in the air. A lot of these athletes for the spring games have really been working towards this for quite some time. So it's very exciting to see all of the outcomes here today. I'm not nervous, no fear. Go, go, go. It's their day to shine. The Special Olympic Spring Games are back. I'm doing run and walk and shot put. <laughs> Starting the day off with opening ceremonies. <laughs> then moving on to the different events with over 600 athletes showing off their skills. What are the events you're doing? Number nine. 50 meter run yes. and standing on jump. I got first place in softball throw. Special Olympics is fun. A running long jump. How do you feel? Sandy. <laughs> <laughs> We are excited that our family and friends gathered here, so thank you all. Starting off as a hugger for the Special Olympics in 1975, Diane Russum is now the area director for Pickens and Oconee County. I'm in my 47th year. I can't imagine not doing it. It's just part of who I am. While this day is filled with competition, it's also about connection and celebration. Do your dreams. Go for your dreams. My ultimate goal is for them to have a good time, to be successful in their events, and to be safe. And I want their parents to applaud their efforts because some of them work really, really hard to do what they do today. You know, it's hard for a kid to run 50 meters who maybe was on crutches two years ago. And this is the first time back since COVID-19 hit back in 2019. That was the last Special Olympics. So a lot of folks out here really excited, really glad that they got to compete today. In Pickens, Anna Arinder, Fox Carolina News.